Welcome to DTV, I'm with uh, Barry Prendergast at the uh, second day of the um, AFL uh, Draft Combine and Barry, uh, it was a late night for you last night doing a lot of interviews, uh, how was the first day? Yeah, yeah, we did about a dozen interviews, uh, finished up around 9.30 last night, so um, trying to knock over as many as we can, so uh, yeah, it was good. Uh, first uh, day of interviewing with the new coach and uh, uh, you know, we had a few of the other coaches come in and sit on in on interviews, so the setup's really good, and uh, we thought the quality of interviews was, was really good. So yeah, it was a good good day. What about the uh, just operational point of view of being at Eddie Had Stadium? How did how did you guys find that on the first day? Yeah, no, it's been good because uh, you know we've got the corporate suites to conduct the interviews in, um, and I think it went pretty smoothly. Uh, uh, because everyone's behind closed doors up in Canberra it's all a bit open so if someone's running a bit behind time and uh, that's interfering with your schedule uh, you can normally say well look because uh, come over here but uh, they're all scheduled interviews um, I think everyone's stuck to the time and um, yeah look we got as many interviews in as we could and uh, uh, we were able to get a bit longer with a couple of guys because they didn't have interviews either side and we had a bit of time so yeah it worked out really well. Yeah. Just a, a general sort of overview of how long would a, an interview go for, roughly about 20 minutes or something like that? Yeah, well they're scheduled for 20 minutes, so the way the schedule is you can't take any more than that. But we did have a bit of a window for one of the uh, other, uh, guys to spend a bit longer with them, which we were keen to do with that particular player. So, uh, yeah, look, it, it's, it's very player specific. Sometimes, uh, you know, if you've got high interest in a player and... We do, uh, we request interviews, but we are scheduled some interviews that we don't request, so, uh, and that's to make sure that, you know, the players get a good participation in the draft camp, which is fair enough, but look, basically we take the 20 minutes for every player and afford them the respect they deserve. Interesting setup this morning uh, on the Etihad Stadium turf. You've got the um, agility and, and sprint testing on the on the new platforms. What, what do you make of that? Oh, well, it's just a a very professional look it's in a great stadium um, they've imported the floor out from over in America and uh, it's a really good setup it's a, a reflection of the combine that occurs in the NFL um, yeah and uh, it, you know everyone's off the arena um, the seating it's good viewing um, yeah it's just a much more comfortable venue um, and in terms of being able to view and everyone to get a good view up in Canberra we tend to all clamber around grab for chairs and get as close to the action as we can in here um, you know everyone gets a good look and it's all very comfortable so uh, yeah it's a great initiative by the AFL. What are some of the other highlights uh, you're looking forward to today? Oh, I take particular interest in the agility, um, uh, but the sprint also, you know, just getting those 20 metre times. Um, but the sprint and agility are the are two key things, and uh, uh, the repeat speed later on in the day. Um, but, you know, the visual f is, is important. Um, some tests are visually more important than others for myself, uh, but that's a personal thing. Um, so I'm looking forward to that, and we've got another round of scheduled interviews as well. So uh, another full day, Matty. Yep. All right, mate. Well, thanks very much for joining us again, and good luck for today. Good on you. Thanks, mate. Thanks.